I've not slept for 24 hours and I'm feeling pretty rough but we can't let that stop us as we continue the adventure. Now you may remember in the last video we saw these magnificent river boats that ply the Ganges and the Brahmaputra. Well now I'm going to jump on one, head down some other town and see what life is like on the river. Join me. Yes, boss. Out of your country. England. England. Yes. I've been asked that question 500 times today. What country? Anyway, we're on the boat. And the ropes are being hoisted. Despite what I thought, the boat's actually leaving in time. But um, we're on the boat, that's the main thing. Whew. Man, and I'm already sweating. It's nine o'clock in the morning. I'm already absolutely soaked through. Wow. I have a feeling this is gonna be a great journey. We're traveling about three or four hours down river to a town called Chanda something. And so um, let's see what the river life is like here in Bangladesh. It's already busy at this time in the morning. Check this out. See all kinds of stuff on the Ganges. Well, let me show you around the boat. That's going to be my home for the next four hours. Let's first of all look at the ground floor and then we go up and I'll show you where I'm staying. Look, you've got shoe shine on board. Look, there you go. Anything you want on here. Anyway, this is third class, the lowest floor basically. And so you have an option down here of either sitting on the benches. And these are the benches you can sit on. Check out the benches. Hello. Hope they brought a pillow. Or instead, you get here the nice, soft, comfortable cinema seats. Check them out. Wow. 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 You do get a lot of wows off the girls in this country. I think it's just because I'm a foreigner, not because of the beard trim. Anyway, have a look here. These are the comfortable seats that the semi-rich people can afford. The semi-rich people afford these and the rich people, they go upstairs. Join me and I'll show you where we're staying. I'm staying somewhere up here. I don't remember where it is. Wait a minute, let me look at my key. So I can remember the number of my cabin. What number am I? Number three, two, one. Are you trying to break into my cabin? Is this for me? Ah, can I? No. What are you doing then? You want to come inside? Thank you. Let me show you where celebrity YouTubers stay. We don't sit on hard benches. We have places like this. Check it out. Yes, sir. Thank you. You still have a son? Honey, water? Okay, water, please. Big one. Big one. Big, big, big. Butter. This here is where the flipping YouTubers stay. Look, you get two beds, two just in case. You never know who I meet downstairs in the third class section. I want to invite up. Um, so you get a bed, you get a bed, you get a little table and chair, some plugs to charge, a fan. Ooh. Oh, hello. Hello. How are you? Are you selfie? Yes, yeah, selfie, of course we can. <laughs> oh wow, thank you. She put a filter so I look like a woman. Perfect. One more? Okay. Can you visit it? No, no, no Bengali. Only English. One more? Come on then. Stop putting silly filters on me. No, Right, there we go. Deco, Vidashiman. Deco. 
BJD. The BJD Marlish Mish. BJD Marlish Mish. No. Wow. Thank you. No, that's true. You're welcome. Nice to meet you. Right. Now we found our cabin. Let's go and um, see what the neighbours are like. Let's meet some neighbours. See where they're up to. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Oh, subscriber. Thank you. Let's see who's down here at the end of this corridor. Anyone home? Any neighbours I can chat to? Oh, oh you oh. are kidding me. What are you doing here? <laughs> I've come to Bangladesh, mate, to vlog. Oh. Get out. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Well, backpack your bed, everyone. Flipping it. Can't get away from the lad. All right. Let's go and have a sleep. Well, it's not the Ritz, but for Bangladesh, it's all right. No need to get that cabin. We're almost pulling into our final destination, the town of Chum something, Chandra, Chandra something, over there in the distance. Apparently, it's famous for its fish. Let's go and check it out. I suppose we've arrived. Should we get off and explore this town? Famous for its fish. Let's go and check it out. Someone's been hit by a stick. There's a man hitting everyone with a stick. Ben, watch out, there's a man with a stick hitting everyone. Oh. Thank you, boss. Take care, bye bye. Hey, hit him, hit him, hit him. Hello, guys. Thank you guys, thank you. Wow. Welcome to Chum. Welcome to a very noisy town in Bangladesh. Is there anywhere in Bangladesh that isn't hectic? That's just like chilled. I know it's time. Wow. There's just trip hazards everywhere, people in your way. Oh fish. Oh. Hello, sir. Nice fish. Wow. I'm not sure I would eat fish from this river. I mean, some of the pollution, I saw dead cows. I saw pollution everywhere. I mean, I don't know. There's a dog having a shit in the river. Hello there, how are you? I'm good. Oh, what's happening? Yes, if you say so. What the hell? Where's Ben gone? Ben's run off. Ben's literally run off and left me in this madness. I don't know how to cope by myself. Okay, sir. Let's go. Forget Ben. Ben had his chance to hang out with me and have fun. 
and he's scarpered. He can figure things out for himself. Where are we going? Who knows? Hey, Benjamin, why are you trying to run away from me? I've caught Benjamin creating content behind my back with two people. Okay, see you later. Give me a text. Straight on, my friend. I don't know where, but let's go. Leave him. We will create our own content without him. Ignore him. He's a selfish content creator. Right, take me to the most interesting place. Hello, guys. England, England. England! So I don't know, whoa. So I don't know what's hammering. I don't know where we're going. I don't know who this guy is, but he seems nice. So we'll just see what happens. Let's see where he takes us. Sometimes in life, you just gotta go with the flow. Let's see what happens. And a random Argentina flag. Wow. Must be some Argentinian hockey players living in this town. Wow, but it's beautiful. Check it out. This is it? This is where you brought me? Ah! What's here? This is it! This is what I travelled all the way from Dakar from. Okay, finish? Okay. How much, sir? How much? How much? Take what I owe you. How much? You choose. Which one? Which one? You choose. Prove that you're honest. Thank you guys. Huh? Okay? Okay? The man took £1.50, which I think is a fair price. Thank you, sir. Walk around and come back. Okay, maybe. Hello, sir. How are you? Okay. You hang around here. You seem like an honest type. Right then, here we are in the town of Chand... I'm okay. What is this town? Champur? Champur. In the town of Champur. Fish, fish. Fish! Oh, there's yeah, fish. Oh my God. And there's a Soviet Ferris wheel or something. So anyway, Champur is famous for its fish. I think that's why people travel down from Dakar. Oh, and here, to prove the point, is a statue of a fish. Eh? Hey? No Chanba now. After. Take it, please. I'm afraid. I'm afraid of my stomach. No, I'm not drinking your water. My God, I don't want men. No meningitis today. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe later. I'm going for a walk. Wow, what a place. I know that the town's famous for fish, but <laughs> I think you would understand if I don't eat any. I'm trying to get through this trip without my stomach getting completely destroyed. Anyway, let's walk around and see what we can find here. An old little Bangladeshi kids park. If you had a child that you loved more than anything in the world, a little boy, let's say, would you allow him to go into this and go around in circles, <laughs> held on by a bit of chain? Yeah, this direction? Maybe you would. I don't know what you're meant to do in these places, apart from look at the river. I could have done this in Dakar, but let's get into the spirit of it. Let's have a little snack or something, and because there's obviously a place that Bangladeshis like to come. So maybe I'm not quite feeling it yet, but hopefully I will. We found the best English speaker in Chandpur. Number one English speaker. Okay, ready? Your big moment, ready? No, I'm fine, I'm fine, thank you. Hey, he's run off, where are you going? Hey, guys, hey, guys. <laughs> he's blushing. Because I said he was the number one English speaker, he ran away. He literally ran away. His big moment. Who's the next? Who's the number two best English speaker? Number two best English speaker. Okay, ready? Yes. Okay, say something. My name is Ahmad. Yeah. Oh, he's back. You're a coward. Come here. What's wrong with you? Why are you run away? It seems people come here 
to eat fish and other things by the river. I don't know why, it's a bit grim. But um, because I don't eat in this country... It is popular for fish. Delicious. Popular for fish. Is it delicious? Yeah, yeah, it's very delicious. Okay. But I'm terrified of eating anything in this country. What's on the other side of the river? What's over there? There is a... You can say there is a big bazaar. Okay, perfect. So on the other side of the river, there's a big bazaar. Yeah, cucumber, tomatoes. Oh, like a vegetable bazaar. Yeah, yeah, vegetable bazaar. So I think maybe I'm going to go across to the other okay. side. You can go there and have fresh vegetables. Well, I always like to eat my greens, my five a day. So I think I'm going to go to the other side and look at the bazaar and then come back afterwards. Okay, guys. Yeah, yeah I can go? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Hello, boss. Okay, thank you. I'm on. Thank you very much. Bye bye guys, it's been emotional, but I'm out of here, wow. Oh. Hello sir, wow, what are you doing? Uh, yeah. Businessman. Uh, yeah, okay. Hello there, businessman. Yeah. Woo. We're here. I'm good, how are you? Wow, oh, they're more friendly on this side of the river. Then you How much? Yeah. Take your money. I don't know, how much? You're taking everything. Yeah? Thank you, sir. You're an honest man. Thank you. Wow. You see that? Bangladeshis are more honest than Indians. If that was an India, that whole bloody wad of cash would have gone. And here, he was like, no. Here, they're like honest. I trust the Bangladeshis. Hello guys, how are you? Hello. Salam, salam, salam. Wow, pan, pan? Oh, okay. You eat? Wow, go on then. Let's see you do it. Shove that thing in your gob. Wow, the whole thing? Wow. Crikey. Must be hungry. Right, let's have a look around. See if we can find it. Hello, sir. Salam alaikum. I like it here, it's like a real old river town, like the old architecture you can see. I don't know when it was built, I suppose the 1930s, 1940s, maybe under the time of the British. But you can still see, hello sir, salam alaikum. You can still see some features from before, the houses, how nice they would have been when they were painted in the past. Probably the houses of rich merchants are now sadly decaying like much like much of Bangladesh. Part of that is just due to the weather. If you live in a monsoon tropical climate, it's hard to keep things up to date, to be honest with you. But um, anyway, salam alaikum. Hello, sir, how are you? Ah, and thank you. Let's look around. Hey, this way? Ben. Hello. Oh, where's he bringing us? You're bringing me to the Corrugated Iron Shop. A must-visit shop on the tour. Um, what is it? Corrugated? Ah, paper. Ah, no, okay. Good. Yeah, hello, everybody. Yeah, I'm interested in buying everything you have in the shop. Yeah. Okay, good. Good. Okay. Chela? Chela. Oh, wow. Wow. That was the corrugated iron shop of whatever this town is called. If you want your corrugated iron, you come here and you buy your corrugated iron. It's the best one in town, I promise you. If you've got a roof with a leak, this is where you come. Cannot tell you how hot it is here. It must be in the high 30s. I am just dripping. It's not even that humid, it's just hot. It's, um, the climate has changed slightly from Dakar. <laughs> And, um, oh, let me walk in the shade. My head cannot take it. Whoa. Oh, and this is the masjid. 
başkanım. Aslamu aleykum. Aleykum aslam. Wow. Ya kırılana. Ne? Patari. Okay. Patari? Yes. Hello, Patari. Okay. Nunca. 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 Okay. Can I have a little? Can I have a little? Danish. 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 I don't know what's going on. I don't know. Okay. Cello, 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 cello. Bye bye, bye bye. Kuda Hafiz. Okay. Go, 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 Yes. Waiting for a boat. Well, this place had zero content, did it? <laughs> it's funny. Yesterday we had all that content in um, Dhaka, and you come here, and there's just nothing. That's the um, unluckiness of the draw sometimes. Anyway, let's cross over back to the other side. See if we can't find Benjamin. Hopefully he didn't find anything more interesting than I did. Hey boys, any chance of a lift over the draw, sir? What? What's your country name? England. 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 I go? I'm with you. Barman, barman. Barman, I go here. Okay, I'm coming. Slowly. Okay. Slowly. Okay, ready? Uh, no, no. Hey! Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Okay, we're gone. Thank you. Guys, thank you. So nice to see you. Thank you for being so friendly. We're going across the water. Wow. Who else gets this send off? Bye bye, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Bangladeshi is something else, aren't they? All right, let's go, my friend. Oh, where's he? He's in a hole. What are you doing down there? Okay. Bye-bye, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Wow. What a country. What a country. I started YouTube about five years ago. I always made jokes about Bangladesh, saying that it was the one country I would never visit. Though I thought it would be hot, sweaty, dirty, noisy. And it is definitely all those things. But what I didn't take into account was the extraordinary friendliness and outgoingness of the local Bangladeshi people. It's been such an eye-opening trip. I've only been here two days, but it's been so eye-opening. And um, it's gone from the place that I would never dream of visiting to the place that one day, you never know, I might even return to. Good old Bangladesh. If I don't get cholera in the next couple of days. Made it. We made it. How much, sir? You take what you need. <laughs> okay? Huh? What do you think of this place, sir? I'm dying, mate. Yeah, I'm so hot. Can we get out of here? Yeah, please. Yeah? Guys, we go home. Back to Dhaka. This is our man who will take us to the boat. Really? Will you? Yeah, he'll take us. He brought me here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my God. I need to get out of here. This is insanely hot. Look at your head. Oh, I am just... Oh, mate, I'm burning up. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Oh, back to the boat. Oh, no. Can we have the roof? <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. It's electric. Electric? Bye yeah, it's electric. Bye-bye, brother. brothers. Hey. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum Study English hard. It's your only chance to get out of this place. Launch, 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 launch. Well, that's the end of our little journey down to this town. Of Chandra, whatever. Let's get back on the boat, head back to Dhaka. Salam alaikum.